Hello. Hello. How are you today? I'm doing well, thank you. What about Good. you? I'm fine, thank you. And uh, what what would you like to do today, one? Uh, would you like to have conversation, read an article, or have a lesson? Um, read an article. It's, it's okay. Be, I think. And is is your reading quite good? Uh, could you repeat? Is your reading quite good? Quite good. Yeah. Is is your reading of a good level? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I'll I'll send you a link for this article then. Okay. Okay. Just one second. I use this quite a lot. It's uh Aaron Ralston's story. Okay. Wow, it's a long story. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> it's interesting, though. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I what? What's? I I don't know anything from from this okay. about this. <laughs> so if if you want to begin reading. Okay. Aaron Ralston, sorry. Okay. Could you share your screen, please? And I, I can, but it might be quite small. Okay. Um, we'll try it, but it could be it could be quite small. Oh, is it okay? Okay. You know, if you have a lesson. It will be better. It will be better, maybe. Okay. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> what what would you like to do? We can do life in the internet age, basic conversation topics, intermediate conversation topics. Intermediate. Intermediate yeah. it will be better, yeah. Okay. And we can have cooking, your dream job, sports, fitness, service animals, social activities, your ideal day, childhood friendships, the importance of family, city life, or online shopping. Uh, social activities, you say social activities. Yeah. Okay. So mm -hmm. social activities, lesson four, 13 slides, intermediate conversation topics, intermediate. Okay. I'll go to okay. slide one. So lesson overview, what we'll cover today. One will be vocabulary, words related to social activities. Two, discussion, social activities, opinions on computer games and social activities. Three, role play, calling your friend and planning a social activity date. Okay, let's okay. go to slide four, uh, two, sorry. Mm -hmm. To warm up, briefly discuss the following questions. What is an activity you like doing outside of work? Outside of work, yeah. Uh, I like to walk me with my dogs, with my pets. Okay. Yeah, maybe today I I will go to the park. But recently, I don't, I don't have the enough time outside my work. Right. <laughs> I hope today. It how will be how many? How mm -hmm. many dogs do you have? One. I have two dogs. Ah, I yes. have two dogs as well. Okay. <laughs> I've that's got good. I've I've got a terrier, and um, a dog that's part hunting dog. Well, okay. Um, so what is? Yeah. What kind? What kind of dogs? Uh, right. One's one's a terrier. Yeah, I I, I listen to you. I listen. And to then you. and then the other is part hunting dog. Okay. He's he's a mixed breed. I think he's I think he's a mix of a Labrador. And some kind of hunting dog. Okay, I have a cattle dog and a pug. Okay, and mm -hmm. uh, what what is a hobby you like to do with other people? Um, I like to I like to play ga uh, games, but on my computer. Yeah, just time in the at the park, but we don't have condition. 
<laughs> La, as how do you say when when you are working also in the same place uh, you don't have uh, too much mobility how do you say that uh you don't have what what ability um sedentary in spanish sedentary i am too much sedentary so that's why i don't have condition if i need to run in the park yeah I, I can't run for a long time. Oh, okay. Okay. And uh, do, you, do your friends have the same interests and hobbies as you? Mm, yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah because uh, we studied uh, yeah. almost the same. We are software engineers, and one of my friends, he is a developer. Um, I have another friend. He is a technical support supporter, support yeah. supporter, yeah, and another technical developer, and yeah, almost all my friends they have things in common, uh, <coughs> like me. Okay, let's go to slide three. So, vocabulary review. Review these terms. The next slides contain practice activities. So we'll practice the pronunciation. Cooking. Okay. Cooking. Art. Art. Yoga. Yoga. Dance. Dance. Bowling. Bowling. Online gaming. Online gaming. Volunteer work. Volunteer work. Movies. Movies. <clears throat> and you understand the meaning of all those, yes? Yeah. I have yeah. a question. Yeah. Uh, could you repeat the pronunciation for dance? Dance. Dance. Yeah. Okay. Uh, dance. Some, some people might pronounce dance. that different because they might say dance. Yeah, uh -huh, exactly. Or yeah. dance. Yeah. So, uh, it just depends. It just depends upon. In the UK, it, it will depend upon where you live in the country as to mm -hmm. whether you say dance or dance. Okay. Okay. It depends. Yeah. Let's go to slide four. Mm -hmm. So vocabulary practice. Which of the activities do you like? Which of the activities do you not like? I like cooking, but I don't know uh, how to do uh, a lot of food. I don't know. I uh, okay. I would like to to learn actually. Yeah. So I, you like I you know. like. You like I cooking, would... but you're not. Um, you like cooking, but you're not um, competent at it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, mm. I, I like cooking. Um, I had to learn cooking when I, me and my girlfriend separated. Okay. <laughs> so, so I had to learn to cook, and I and I enjoy cooking now. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I like to cook. But I don't know how to do many things. Yeah, uh, may, maybe just practice because mm -hmm. that, that's just what I did. I just kept practicing. Yeah, but if you want to practice, you need time. And yeah, I don't have enough time for a lot of things that I want to do. Ah, OK. Um, I I always I often make curry. OK, I have to make uh, Indian style curry. And for quite a long time, I couldn't I couldn't get my curries very spicy. And I, okay. and I kept and I kept asking friends how they do curries, and uh, they they kept telling me, use this, use that, use this, and use that various ingredients. So I did I did all that, and I still couldn't get my curries spicy. Okay. And then, and then by chance, I looked at a video on YouTube of a in a traditional Indian chef making a curry base. Curry base. Uh, yeah. The the, you know, the curry uh, juice. Yeah. Juice. Could you, could you type the word curry, please? I'll type it curry base. Okay. Okay, curry base. Yeah. So, so you'd make a curry base, 
but but my my curry bases were never very spicy and this indian chef what he always does is fry all the spices just gently before you actually cook it and mm -hmm. for some and for some reason that makes all the spices so much uh more flavorful and um it, it now my curries are extremely spicy since i've done that and i always i always do that now before i cook the curry okay let's go to slide five do you think online gaming is a social activity? Why or why not? More or less. <laughs> yeah, more or yeah, less. Yeah, because you know people, you talk yeah. with people, yeah. uh, you share experience, different topics, but it's not the same. Yeah, it's yeah. not the same when you, you can face, you, you can see the people face to face mm. and you can share different things that you don't uh, yet you can't when you are talking up uh, uh, ultra uh, or ultra online it's, it's different yeah so uh, uh, it's, uh, yes think, yes it's uh, a social activity but not it's not enough i think yeah. if you want to know people yeah uh, i think i think when when you do online gaming when you're speaking to other people that are playing the game yeah Mm -hmm. You're you're nearly always talking about the game, exactly. So so you're not you're not really um, getting to know them. You you're getting to know how they play the game, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what why do you think why do you think social activities are popular among adults? Among adults, yeah. social social activities yeah so why do you think social activities are popular among adults like facebook uh facebook it could be anything any kind of social activity social activities activities sociales so ah, okay anything social yeah okay. any any t any type of social activity uh play play a uh, sport parties yeah but but why why do you think they uh... ah, okay why do you think social activities are more popular yeah among among adults yeah sorry but i don't know what's mean among ah, okay entre entre nosotros entre adultos okay. este okay uh because uh adults the adults or the people when when you are an, an adult you work all the day you work every almost every day all the time because if you don't work you don't have money so you need this kind of social activities because you, you yeah. need to uh, how do you say liberar or you need leave to... the stress yeah, yeah, you uh, you need them um, social activities to. Uh, we we often say take your mind off work. <laughs> relieve, relieve stress. You you need to relieve stress. Yeah. So mm -hmm. uh, relieve the stress, or what? <laughs> what we often say is take your mind off work. Exactly, take your mind off work. Okay, so let's it's, go. It's, it's to... very important because yeah, yeah, because yeah, para mantener una una mente limpia, es saludable. Do you know what means saludable? Health, no. healthy, healthy. To mind to maintain a healthy mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go to slide six. Do you think old people and young people enjoy the same types of social activities? Some, some activities, but some, some just some yeah. activities like yeah. soccer, for example. Right. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, on, online games, mm -hmm. uh -huh. but the people live this these social activities 
in different way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, I, 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 yeah. Because... People enjoy the same uh, some some types of social activities. Yeah. How Up how important how important is it for you to have social activities? I think it's very important. Like I uh, like I said before. Uh, yeah, for example, in my case, I, I work every day from home. Yeah. Monday to Friday, um, closed. Or how do you say that? Closed in the same place, or how do you say that? Or working in the same place. For example, there is my kitchen, my living room, my yeah, uh, yeah, my bed bedroom. But my my door is is always closed. Right. Yeah. When my wife arrives at afternoons, sometimes we we go to maybe the Seven Eleven. Also, do you know what what's mean? Also, Seven Eleven is like a, a small supermarket. I don't know. Convenience oh, okay. store. It's a convenience yeah. store. Yeah. We go for um, coffee or chocolate or oh, she, she something goes, like that. You go, you go to relax together. Yes. Mm -hmm, exactly. <clears throat> um, but recently, I I am concentrated in my work and in to learn English and practice. So yeah. I don't have the enough time. Okay. But yeah, it's very important. So when it's on weekend, I advantage uh, this uh, to, to two days, Saturday and. and and Sunday, yeah, for to visit my some friends. Okay, mm -hmm. let's let's go to slide seven. Do you think modern lifestyles give people enough leisure time to spend with others? To spend. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what's mean leisure. Uh... <laughs> Okay, suficiente, supongo, uh, to spend, spend with others. Okay, it depends. Yeah. Yeah. Tú necesitas organizarte. I, I don't know the word. Tú necesitas. Wait. Poquito. Ah, yeah. Uh, you need to organize yourself. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's the yeah. answer. Yeah, but, uh, but I know with this st lifestyle in this time. Yeah. Uh, we are really busy. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, we need to organize with all of the things that uh, I need to do. And we could find a little, maybe uh, some space for to know other people. Okay. Okay. Do you, do you think people in your country value social activities? Do you think people in your country value social activities? Yes, I think. I think yeah. so. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go to slide eight. Some people would argue that computers will make people more isolated and decrease their social skills. Other people argue that technology will create more social activities. Which which opinion do you agree with? Explain your reasons. Okay, I, I will read again. <laughs> okay, some some people would argue that computers will make people more isolated. I, how do you say that? What is the pronunciation? I, I, isolated. 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 Yeah. And decrease their social skills. Other people are. Argue? Is argue? Other people argue. Argue. Argue? Yeah. yeah. That technology will create more social activities. Which opinions do you agree with? Explain your reasons. Um. Yeah, I think uh, computers n not 
not only computers, mm, the smartphones and different uh, kinds of, of technology, yeah. different kinds of social social media, yeah, uh, increasing this um, comportamiento. Wait. Mm. This behavior is is it makes yeah. sense for you? Yeah, this, this behavior, behavior, yeah. behavior, behavior. Yeah. yeah. But with the new uh, social activities with technology, you can to know more people. Like for example, that like the influencer, or yeah. with this technology, you can uh, to know people um, in any part of the world yeah. you can you can to have friends from spain from india from uh, any part of the world yeah yeah okay let's go to slide nine preferred social activities imagine you're in this situation role play with me one of your friends recently started spending almost all of his time online and started not coming to any of the friends get togethers. You texted him to check in, but the friend said that he is as social as ever, but just, but now just online instead of face to face. You're still worried about him and you decide to call him. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's my it's my turn. It's my turn. Yeah. Mm, okay. Hi. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Why? Okay. I'm I'm worried. I'm worried worried for you. Oh, why you are you to, worried? You need to go outside. You need to know uh, new people. I I can't I can't go outside one because of the COVID. Okay, okay, I understand <laughs> your reason, but uh, you need to do social activity. Um, what do you think if uh, we go to how do you say it? we go to uh, have a dinner or yeah, you, you could say, uh, how about we go out for lunch? Okay, how about we got for lunch yeah that sounds like a good idea yeah i know <laughs> okay when do so, you want to go when do you want to go one when okay we we could to go uh, tomorrow or not at night okay yep that sounds great okay good okay okay you convinced me let's go to slide 10. okay So planning a social activity day. Imagine you're in this situation, role play with me. You have to plan a social activity day for your co-workers or classmates. If, if you have three social activities that help the group feel closer together, what social activities would you choose and why? Okay. I choose uh, a party. <laughs> a party. <laughs> yeah, a party. Yeah. Of a, a, a group dinner. Yeah, so you'd uh, have a group dinner, yes? Mm hmm. Group okay. dinner. I, 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 I choose. Like, uh -huh. Yeah, I like the idea of a party. <laughs> yeah, we. We could to drink some beer. Yeah, that that sounds good. Yeah, how so, do you say we we talk each other with uh, different topics? Or we, how do you we, say that? We, we can chat together. We can we can we can we can ch chat together. Chuck, chat, check, chat. Okay, so you could say. We can chat together. Chat together. Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, you can use, can you use this word when you are talking face to face? Yeah. Chat. Yeah, okay. that's, that's, that, that's when you're going to use it, actually. You wouldn't, you wouldn't use it if you're writing. Uh huh. Because it's quite, um, so sort of almost like slang. It isn't, but it's, it's, she's using it in an almost like slang way. Okay, why why not we can talk each yeah. other or, or together? Uh, you'd, if if you wanted to say that, you'd say uh, we can. When when you use each other, is when you are talking just with one people, one we person. Talk, we can talk with each other, yes. Or say we okay. can talk, we with, can each talk other. With, each, with each other. <laughs> Or, Con cada uno. or you could even say we could talk together. Okay, we can talk together. Okay. Uh huh. So, but you, it's more usually use chat. Yeah, yeah. If it, it, it most, it, in, uh -huh. English English people will often say, "Ah, oh, let's 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 get together and have a chat." Okay, let's let's get together, have a chat. Yeah. Okay, it makes sense. Yeah, we we say we we often say things like that rather than uh, talk, etc. Because talk sounds a little bit. Um, uh, it's 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 how you would write it, but not say it. We e English people often say things totally different to what to the way they would write the same thing. Okay. How <laughs> often? How often uh, do you talk with people from the U.S., for example? Um, ne never on air, but I used to. I used to always chat with them because uh, I used to go to America quite a lot. Okay. I used, to, I used to go. I used to go to America maybe three times a year. And do you have problems? Uh, understanding when they are talking no. with you? No. No. no I, I can understand everything. The, the the only confusing time I had okay. was <laughs> was when I when was when I was uh, shopping at Woodbury Common and it got cold. So I decided I'd buy a jumper, okay? Okay. A sweater. And I went I went in the shop and I said, Do you have any jumpers? And the ladies looked at me really funny. <laughs> and I thought, why are they looking at me like that? Anyway, they said, uh, we do, sir, but not in your size. So I went out and I said to my cousin, I said, I've just asked for a jumper. And they said, they've got them, but not in my size. And he started laughing. And I said, what's wrong? He said, a jumper in America is a long woolen dress for a woman. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I so, I I'd, I'd asked if they'd got a long long woolen dress <laughs> rather so than one of these. The problem is not the accent. The problem no, there the there the are words. the words. Yeah, different the words the word. for the same yeah. thing. Yeah, right. In in England, in England, for a cigarette, in slang, mm -hmm. we say a fag. Okay, a fag. Okay. Yeah. In America, a fag is a man who wears women's clothes, a transvestite. Well, so if if you say, uh, I was at a barbecue and I said, are you having a fag? Meaning, are you having a cigarette? And the guy got upset with me because he thought, that I meant, is he going to go find a transvestite? Mm -hmm. So you've got, you've got to learn the words you've got to learn the meanings of the words in american english as well yeah recently i i've had uh, calls with people from the uk more yeah. than americans yeah okay okay we'll we'll have to finish because uh we've, we're out of time and i've got another call coming in okay well i've enjoyed okay. shooting you and i'll message you afterwards okay Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 See you. Bye.